call a doctor's journey in public service. Dr. Anthony Fauci takes you through his 54 years with the National Institute of Health. There's always been disagreements, uh, of course. I mean, that's why our country is a great country. You have people who have different ideological views, but the disagreements were always associated with civility, mm -hmm. with respect for each other, and for respect for institutions mm. in the government. So you could have a disagreement, but at the end, you try and compromise. What happened with COVID, as I think was represented by the hearing a few weeks ago, mm -hmm was just pure ad hominem and vitriol. And that really took me by surprise. I mm. thought that there would be that kind of give and take and respect each other's disagreements. And that's the thing that worries me, not only about what I have to face, but about the direction of the country and the, yes. and the, and the social order in our democracy. It, mm -hmm. it's, it's very threatening, I think. It's in jeopardy. It's in jeopardy. You were particularly disturbed, I read, <laughs> by his refusal to wear a mask. Yeah. Right now, people should not be walking. There's no reason to be walking around with a mask. Should you be wearing two masks or one mask? I often myself wear two masks. Can we make a general recommendation that doesn't have scientific basis yet? No. Please wear a mask. The chances of my getting infected in an indoor setting is extremely low. And that's the reason why in indoor settings now, I feel comfortable about not wearing a mask because I'm fully man, I'm fully vaccinated. When you're in a congregate indoor setting, wear a mask. 